Um, yeah. I'll open the meeting. The Zoning Board of Appeals will hold a uh, public hearing on the 10th of January, uh, Thursday, in the Senior Center um, at 7 p.m. on the petition of Eden Lakeview Development LLC, six comprehensive permit. Um, at this point, it's for 86 units. Uh, rental housing on 4.23 acres of land that is partially um, in the residential zone and partially in the industrial zone under Massachusetts General Laws Chapter 40B, Sections 20 through 23, with waivers from the zoning requirements on the property compromising six parcels known as Zero Lake Avenue, Map 17, Lot 131, Zero Lake Avenue, Map 18, Lot 2, 23 through 25 Lakeview Avenue, Map 18, Lot 1, Zero Eden Street, Map 17, Lot 274, Zero Eden Street, Map 17, Lot 275, and 128 Eden Street, Map 17, Lot 276 from Reading, Massachusetts. Um, I will dispense with reading the body's list. This is quite lengthy. Um, this is our sixth meeting. Um, there is a, a slight uh, hitch in this meeting this evening. We are down to four members on the board. Um, one of our members uh, could not make it this morning, this evening, because of uh, two little children, one of which has been taken to the hospital. Um, as we have done in the in the past, when situations like this come up, uh, we consult the applicant, ask, ask, the, ask the applicant if he wishes, they wish to uh, continue to a date certain when the board will be complete again, or if he wishes to, or if they wish to com continue with the four members. So I'm going to turn this over to Chris and let Chris explain the situation, and then we'll go to the applicants and see what they wish to do. Sure. Uh, I think I think you explained it uh, well, Mr. Chairman. The only other thing I'd add is that um, the the, the, mem the board member who's absent tonight has already missed um, one session of this public hearing. And under Massachusetts law, um, a, a member of a board of this type can miss and remain eligible to vote on the application at the conclusion of the public meeting. So uh, if, um, if Eric were to miss um, a evidentiary hearing previously, as he has, um, and then miss another one this evening, he would be disqualified from voting on the application, which would leave the applicant with um, only four voting members um, and needing, um, in order to obtain an approval of the comprehensive permit, uh, needing three out of four vo uh, voting members rather than three out of five. And he has already exercised his option under the uh, the Mullen rule, Mullen right? Rule, the, the, so. the Mullen rule allows, uh, after missing one session of the public hearing, a board member can review the tape um, and all of the materials submitted during the session that they missed, uh, and then become eligible to vote again. But if that happened, that that for reasons that are um, not within our control under state law, that is not true if the if the board member misses two Second. sessions. So at this point, we would go to the applicant and ask what your uh, wish would be, whether we continue with the four members this evening, which would mean we only have four voting members at the end of the process, or would you like to continue and give us an extension? And I think the suggestion was that if you were to give us another 30 days beyond um, what we had intended to, to complete. Um, we do have two more meetings scheduled for this month, the 24th and the 31st. The 24th and the 30th? 30th, yeah. 24th and the 30th. Um, the intention would be to try to meet that, uh, but we've got quite a bit to cover. So um, in my mind, if you were to exercise that option, uh, it would give uh, both of us, the board, the town, and you and the development uh, team an additional time to get this done correctly. Thank you, Mr. Chair. Uh, just for the record, Jesse Schomer, the law firm of Britain, Ante Staria for the applicant. Our preference at this time would be to continue and, and so that we can, can continue with the full board, be able to go on the proceeding. And I believe either of those two dates that you mentioned would be acceptable to us. 
first date you said? 30th. 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 